So I have kids. You have yeah. kids, right? Do you have kids? Yeah. We all do. Yes. All of kids. Great. So when it comes to free will, I get it. I'm completely on board, Sam, with your idea that we, there's no free will. No. When it comes to raising kids, where's Don't the... tell them. Don't tell them that there's no free will. So I have, a, I have, you know, I have an 18-year-old boy uh, who's, you know, gorgeous. Mm-hmm. And when I'm trying to tell him to do the right thing and he does something stupid, and then I want to find out why he did that, I don't even ask because it's a stupid question because he doesn't even know why he did it, because he's an 18-year-old boy. But when I'm looking at impacting his future behavior, where's the practical separation between knowing that there's really no free will and wanting your children to be responsible in their behavior and what they do in the world? Okay. Well, this is an important question. I, I think there are many false assumptions about what it must mean to think that there's no free will. So I, I think there's no free will, but I think effort is incredibly important, right? And I, I think there's, there, there, you can't wait. A, I mean, the example I use in my book, I think, is you know, if you want to learn Chinese, you can't just wait around to see if you learn it, right? It's not going to happen to you. I mean, there, there's a way to learn Chinese, and you have to do the things you need to do to learn Chinese. Otherwise, it's not going to happen. Every skill you, or system of knowledge you could master... Uh, is like that. And getting off of drugs is like that. And getting into shape is like that. And straightening out your life in any way that it's crooked is is like that. But the recognition that you didn't make yourself and that you are exactly as you are at this moment because the universe is as it is in this moment has a, a flip side, which is you don't know how fully you can be changed in the next moment by good company and good conversations and reading good books. And you don't know what, I mean, you, you, are, you are an open system, right? And we, it's just a simple fact that people can radically change themselves. You're not condemned to be who you were yesterday. So I'm a, I'm a huge fan of, of people who are totally off this message, like someone like Jocko Willink, right? The Navy SEAL who's He's like the opposite of me in every respect, right? And, and so even on this question of free will. He, he's scared of you, by the way. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but, I mean, so he's, he's all about effort and, and discipline. And it's all true that all of all, you know, discipline matters. Discipline has consequences. But again, in each moment, if you put on Jocko's podcast tomorrow and it changes what you're going to do with your day by 25% and it's crucial to your happiness... You, again, you're not in a position to know why it, it did that that day and didn't do it last Thursday. And you, you're not even in a position to know to why you turned it on, really. And again, you're, just, you're open to the universe. But again, there's immense freedom in that. It's not, you're, you can keep going in the direction that, that you, you want to go. But as far as to what to tell kids, you need a strong sense of agency. The, the measure of what to tell kids is what's, what to tell anybody, ultimately, is what's true and useful. Right? It's not just all that you just don't download random truths because some truths are, are, I think, not worth knowing at certain moments in life. Right? You don't tell your eight-year-old about all the ways in which human beings can become diseased and die early and you know, childhood cancer is on the menu. And you know, Do you want to talk about that now? That's not, there's, there's too much reality at certain moments. And I, mean, I think empowering kids to feel like they can seize the reins of their lives is, is worth doing. I mean, assuming that there is no free will, the parental machines that are pre-programmed to communicate that there is free will to the machines that have no free will that are their children, those, those machines will do better. So probably you were sent right. here by, uh, by Laplacian determinism to ask this question so that we could respond without choice to tell you <laughs> <laughs> tell you to lie that. Yeah. <laughs>